Good morning students, today I am going to discuss some questions in chemistry and uh, it is the next part of chemistry, ABC of chemistry. First question is, what are promoters in a chemical reaction? Answer is, substances that improve the efficiency of a Catalyst are called promoters. For example, molybdenum, whose symbol is MO, acts as a promoter to increase the efficiency of the catalyst. That is iron. Here, catalyst is iron. In the formation of uh, ammonia that is an H3 gas from hydrogen and nitrogen. Promoters can not work without a catalyst. So the reaction is one molecule of nitrogen and three molecules of hydrogen reacts. In the presence of catalyst iron and uh, atmospheric pressure is kept between 200 to 900 and temperature is kept 450 degrees Celsius and then we get two molecules of ammonia and heat is produced and it is a reversible reaction. That means Again, these two molecules of ammonia gas converts into three molecules of hydrogen gas and one molecule of nitrogen gas. So this sign, that is reversibility sign, has been given here. And here MO is acting as promoter, MO is molybdenum. Now second question is, <coughs> Why is a positive ion is smaller than the corresponding atom? Answer is in the formation of a positive ion from a neutral atom, one or more electrons have been lost. And thus, the net positive charge on the nucleus attracts the rest of the electrons to a greater extent as compared to the attraction exercised on all the Electrons in the neutral atom. Hence, the size of the positive ion is smaller than the neutral atom. Now, the next question is third number. Why should a bottle of H2O to be cooled before opening. Answer is a bottle of H2O2 be cooled before opening to decrease the pressure of O2 produced there due to partial decomposition of H2O2. That means two molecules of H2O2 is partially decomposed, it is not completely decomposed because two molecules of water we get and oxygen gas is released. 
Fourth question is why does sulfur dioxide dissolve in water to give an acidic solution? Answer is sulfur dioxide dissolves in water to form sulfurous acid that is H2SO3 which ionizes to give hydrogen ions and thus behaves as an acid. The reaction is as follows. SO2 plus H2O arrowhead H2SO3 and uh, this again changes into hydrogen ion plus HSO3 ion. Again it is a reversible reaction. Yeah, it is not stable, it is unstable reaction. So again from this we get sulfurous acid. And again these two ions, hydrogen is here, cation and HSO3 is an ion. Again this is reversible and it gives us two hydrogen ions and SO3 that is sulfite ions. It is also reversible, it is not stable. Fifth question is, why is ferrous ammonium sulfate whose formula is FSO4 dot NS4 whole 2SO4 dot 6S2, 6 molecules of water is also present, that means water of crystallization is 6. Used as a volumetric reagent for for manganate and dichromate titrations. Answer is it is used as a volumetric reagent for for manganate and dichromate titrations in preference to ferrous sulfate. Because it that means uh, ferrous ammonium sulfates crystals do not lose water in air. Yeah, and that's why prefer this. Thank you. If you like, please share and subscribe.